Angelica. It's Angelica, oh, it's Angelica right? right? Yeah. Did I not just give him another opportunity to take his hat off? Yeah. And did he refuse to do it again? All right. Did you just give her another opportunity? Did he refuse to do it again? Opportunity to go All right. Something on here? Acts chapter three. Come on. Acts like, huh? chapter three, verse nineteen. Come on. Repent, ye therefore. And be converted. We need strong men that can lead our woman. Yes, right. Woman is the weaker yes, vessel. And I'm right, right. Head. So I'm we right should, head, but I'm not so, going behind So, so our, our men shouldn't have the same standards as women. You That's understand right. that, right? Our standards should be greater. Right. Because we stronger. Right. Right? right? And we the head. Yes, right? Sir. Yes, sir. All right. So, yes, so why, why would you point at her and say, "Well, did you not because give her a chance her. to put a head cover on her head? Did because you not? Why you would mean. you say that? Look at what why, you why would you do that? You been talking you, you're greater than that, Stefan. Stefan, listen to me. You you're greater than that, bro. Right. You're greater than that, man. I am. That's why I keep my hand on Don't let me ever see you compare yourself to a woman again. God created you to be a man, bro. He created you to be a man. All right. I need you to believe that. I need you to believe that, bro. I already believe that. Yes, I that. do. I believe you got. that already. Repent ye therefore and be converted. That's your sin. What? That your know. sin. God says means. the only way for Anybody your sins to means. be blotted out is to repent. Come on. May be blotted out. Read it again from the top. Repent ye therefore. So God says if you repent, come on. And be converted. And change. Converted. And it to convert. convert it. Can you can you convert and stay the same at the same at the same time? Can you? If someone sold you a convertible yeah. and the top so ain't rolled back, would you be satisfied with that? No, no you wouldn't. Mean. Right? If someone sold you a convertible, right, and the top don't go back, would you would you be satisfied with that? All right. So God's not satisfied with you if you don't change, brother. It's that simple. It's that plain. It's that hard to understand. Read it again from the top. Come on. Repent, ye therefore. Converted. God I'm says be converted, be converted right? That means to stay the same on the change. That means to continue to get tattoos or stop getting tattoos. That means to keep your head on and take your head off. That means to keep that means to keep the idol on your neck. Hold on. That means to keep the idol on your neck or take the idol off your neck. Take the idol off. This is easy. It's easy. Come on. That your sins may be blotted out when the times of refreshing shall come. From the presence of the Lord. Now, hey, Job chapter 22, this is for you, sis. Job chapter 22, verse 5. Hey, do Don't forget the point. We are here to teach our people, all right, God's commandments. We want all our people to come back to the true black Messiah. That's, That's what we right. Want. That's what we want. And, and, and following his example that he set for Who? us on this earth. Who? The black Messiah. The black Messiah. Right. The black Messiah. That's right. The black Messiah. That's right. Messiah. That's right. Do you he understand? Jesus. Do you understand? He said Jesus. Jesus and the black Messiah is the same person. That's right. Read what you got. Calls real Deuteronomy Calls chapter real 22 name. verse 5. The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. So God says that the woman shouldn't wear that which pertains to a man, right? What is God's real name? All right. He's talking about the name, right? but he didn't read the scripture that say God exhorts his word above his name. You see, right. that's why you can't follow natural men. Right. All right. Don't no, doesn't make sense. Doesn't make sense. Doing right now was All right. natural. All right. I would not be talking to you. You just heard what he said, right? Camera. What about the name? What about the name? What, what about the name? name? What about the name? name? Can you tell me his tell name? Me I want to know his name. If I know his name, you I'm still gonna have an idol on my neck. What difference is it gonna make? This is not an idol. It's a piece of jewelry. It's a it's an idol, bro. It's an idol. I'm trying to Psalm chapter 138, verse 2. What is the natural man? All right. Because I'm a natural man. All right. Psalm chapter 138, verse 2. I'm a man of God, too. I'm going to be both. I'm you're going to be, you're gonna be oh, natural, you're going to be spiritual. Right. Here's what you got. Psalm chapter 138, verse 2. I will worship toward thy holy temple. Psalm chapter 138, verse 2. I will worship toward thy holy temple. And praise thy name. Praise what? Praise thy name. But I want to know the name. So, so praise man. thy name. But I, I got to know God's name. Come on. Praise thy name. Is it? Is it Yahweh? Is it is it Jehovah? Is it is it Yahweh Shah? What's his name? What is it? Is it Yahushua? Which one is? Is it Yeshua? What's his name? I want to know his name. What's his name? What's his name? What's his name? Come on. And praise thy name. God say praise thy name. Right. Come on. For thy love and kindness, and for thy truth. Come on. For thou has magnified thy word. God said that he magnified his Bible and his commandments and you taking your head off, all right, when the scriptures are coming out. God said he magnified that above what? Above all thy name. Is that so is that hard to understand? I so ask, just, I does God you. reverence his name above his commandments or does he put his commandments above his name? Which one? 
Am I going to get the kingdom of heaven if I know God's name, but I'm breaking all his commandments? Teach! All right? Don't do that. Or am I going to get the kingdom of heaven? Or am I going to get the kingdom of heaven if I know his name, but I'm breaking all God's commandments? Which one am I going to get the kingdom of heaven? Hey, bro. We're going together. Hey, bro. Right? I got to know. I got to be keeping the commandments, right? Right. According to the scripture, God said that his commandments is above his name. That's easy to understand. Right. You want him. That's easy to understand. You want him. All right. I you understand. Want you want we him. answering all your questions, bro. No, you ain't answering. All right. You I, want we him. answering all your questions, bro. No, you just bro. talking out of the goddamn book. You want <laughs> You hate this book, don't you? Oh, you want all right. First Thessalonians chapter four, verse eight. All right. No, no. We gonna keep reading out this book until you leave, bro. Right. We gonna keep reading out this book until you leave, bro. You hate this book. No. Yeah, you do. Don't. All right. But I'm gonna show you. You right. All right. Yeah, you don't hate. I haven't left yet. You don't hate the book. I'm gonna show you who you hate. Read what you got. First Thessalonians. Chapter 4, verse 8. He therefore that despises, despises not man. You don't hate us. You're right. You don't hate us. Who you hate? Come on. But God. Who you hate? But God. Who I am book? God. But I God. Am God. Who gave these commandments? But God. Who told him to take his head off? But God. Who hey. told him to take his idol off his neck? But God. Who did that? God did that, brother. You don't hate so, us. So God we, we didn't write this down. book. God said, yes, God. yes, 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 right, we didn't write this book, he told me God wrote God this book, brother, right. all right, so, you really, he really ain't got, sister, Angelica, that. you realize he really ain't got no problem with us, right, who he got a problem with, God, That's right? right, he got a problem with God, right, now, God is probably the last person that you want to have a problem with, bro, right. he probably the last person, you in danger of the judgment, bro, right. thank you, everybody get a brother a hand, no, no, oh, no, oh, no, he not, he not no, coming for that. no, all right, hold the hand, hold the hand, look, you see how, you see how bad we want you to repent, bro? Give me, give me Luke chapter 15. I think it's verse 23 of one. All right? Do you, do you see, Angelica, do you see how bad we want the brother to repent and to get right? We ain't out here to destroy him. We ain't out here to destroy you, bro. Is that what I want? 15? No, 14 and 8. 14, I want just but one sinner. Just rejoicing in heaven. 15 and 10. Read that for me, please. Come on. Luke chapter 15, verse 10. Likewise, I say unto you, there is joy in the presence of the angels. That means there's joy in the heavens. And all the angels rejoice. When what? Come on. In the presence of the angels of God over one sinner. One sinner just like Stefan. Come on. That repentance. Just like Angelica that does what? That repentance. It's joy for you, right sister. You repent. Do you understand that? That means it's a spiritual realm and they're rejoicing in the heavens because Angelica repented to them. Right. It's joy in the heavens. When Stefan repents, if he don't get put to death first, you, said, you understand? Repent. It will be it will be joy in the heavens no. for you. you said, it will be you said, joy repent. in the heavens for you if you repent before you Where get put I to death. From? It will Where be joy in the heavens for you. From? You're sick from the idol on your neck, from having a head on your head while we preaching the scripture, Teach. not having fringes on your clothes. Teach. You understand? So, not, not marrying so the first woman that you that you have sex with. Hold on, hold on, not hold on, not Exodus chapter sixteen. Not marrying the first woman that you had sex with. All right. That, yes, that's you were supposed to do that. That's a law. Right. Jay Angelica, did you know that? All right. Now, but natural men don't keep that law. Right. You probably dealt with plenty of natural men in this world, but you ain't so never you dealt with a spiritual man. Ask me how I know. You because he's not here with you. He will be standing right beside you, right? You know, but when you deal with when you deal with natural men, when you when you deal, hold on, when you deal with natural men, you know what happens? They leave. Right. They leave. Right. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, Read what you got. Exodus chapter 22, yeah, verse 16. Come on. And if Sorry, a man bro. entice a maid that is not betrothed. This is, this is scripture right here. Come on. Uh, read the one. And lie with her. So if you read the one, game read to a sister, one say that if then I you have sex one. with her. Come no. on. Read he one. shall surely endow her to be his wife. If you if you have sex with a sister, the Bible saying, look, you gotta marry her. You gotta marry. That's what the scriptures say. Wouldn't that change our communities today? If there was a law in place that if a man had sex with a woman, he had to marry her or got put to death? Don't you think that would change our community today? Don't you think that would change our? It would make that man think twice about him having sex with you, right? He would think twice about it. He would think twice about it, right? Right? He would think twice about it. Then we just talk to you about repentance. I repented, brother. Right. We used to scream "Black Power" while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. 
Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how we're men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. I, U, I, C, we deliver the truth.